Hello, and welcome to another exciting episode of Fargo Retro Plays Magic the Gathering Arena. I believe this is episode four, and at the end of the last episode, I got to gold and rank standard, and I haven't really played since then. Uh, played a little bit here to try and push off some of the uh, dailies building up, but looks like they built up. I don't really have time to do a... Um, I don't really have time to do a, uh, I wanted to do a draft of some type. Take a look at the drafts that are still available. 5,000 coins. I wanted to do a draft. I don't really have time to do that. Um, it's Tuesday afternoon. I want to get a video recorded for Wednesday. So, I think we're going to look at some of the packs here. It looks like I have eight packs built up. Um, I got some of those, uh, from playing, etc. So, let's take a look at some of the stuff we got here. Uh, we're still sticking with the red-blue theme for now. This spell costs two counter blue unless it pays. Okay. Some counter. I was thinking about adding some counter. Whenever you draw your second card each turn, create a blue flare your token. Sure, sure. Charming Prince. He does look pretty charming. What do you know? So, again, we're focusing on the red-blue cards, but again, we're opening some packs here to start off. This is kind of fun. Got a Ginger Brute, got a Henge Walker, Lonesome Unicorn, Fierce Witch Stalker with the Golden Egg as our commons. Uh, we got a Lucky Clover whenever you can copy it, you mentioned your target. That's pretty neat. I like that. Uh, Fairy Vandal. Sure. What do we got for our big draw? Castle Arden Vale. Alright. What else we got here? Go ahead and take a look. We got some blues. Draw three cards. If at least three blue and spent this. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Another lucky clover, so maybe make some sort of adventure deck in the future. Stolen by Faye. That'd be pretty nice to have. Board wipe and put up some defenders. Wow. Oko! Big Oko. Oko's tough. Oko's been very frustrating to deal with, so. I mean, it's my turn to get an Oko death go deck going on. Alright, we got the Vantress Gargoyle. Of good stuff here in the packs but let's go through again we have some counters blues adding a lot of counters in this set Bat, black lance paragon that's pretty cool so maybe we'll have to look at adding some counter to the deck Sweet. <clears throat> so that is some of our packs that we opened up. Uh, let's take a look, moment to go through our deck here. Um, see if there's anything we can. Benthic Biomancer. Anticipate. I was thinking to get rid of that for, um, where is it? It's a little bit more expensive to cast, obviously. 
chemister's insight. So get rid of some of the, the anticipate, put in a chemister's insight, maybe even a second chemister's insight. Get rid of this lava coil. Maybe get rid of the guild mage. I don't use that very often. Get rid of this. I never use that either. Get rid of the ley line of anticipation. Um. What else we got here? So, goblin. Electromancer. We could add one more there. A good idea. Otherwise, what about our ley lines? Maybe get one more of these bad boys. Move, Mizzet, Perun. Spitfire. fill out the Spitfires. Okay. Like it. So we'll try with this adjustment here. We'll play a couple of live games, live ranked games. So here we go. We did a little card maintenance. We opened a couple packs, uh, looked at our deck a little bit, made a couple of changes here, make it a little more focused. Um, pushing the curve up a little bit. Obviously, I took out some of the lower level cards. Put in a couple higher value ones, but that is okay. See, there we go. Play this all day. Okay, so I'm gonna play the that. I'm not gonna play the spitter on the first turn. I think the fire mines research is more important. Uh, run away whenever you cast this spell. And whatever. Okay. Alright. So, we got this. We'll do this. He's gonna pump this dude. Pump those dudes pretty good. Deal some damage to me. What do we got here? We got a shock. Excellent. Shock. We will put a radical idea, draw a card. Excellent. Alright, so I'll probably drop the Scorch Spitter, play the Risk Factor, and go from there. Some damage. That's some damage there. Alright, so here, change this up a little bit. We'll play the shock. We'll play the risk factor. He's probably gonna take the damage, I would imagine. That is okay. I'm gonna make him take that damage a couple more times. Spitfire. A lot of goblins. A lot of goblins coming at me here. Okay, he needed to do that. Otherwise, I was gonna, I was gonna bonk him.
Off to a nice start here. Take one tick on the gold. Ooh, does it start to come down a little on the... Okay, okay. Looks like it starts to come down a little bit. We're no longer getting two ticks for our wins. We're only getting one. So that means maybe not fly through the game so quickly. Maybe not give up uh, on bubble games. Um, I definitely would give up on bubble games. Uh, we're going to mulligan this bad boy. Uh, we're going to keep this one. And we're going to put the Pyro Helix back. Start with that in play. Drop that. Off to the races. Okay, so cool beans. That's what I wanted to see. That is definitely what I wanted to see. Sounds good. We'll drop another bad boy down. No blocks. Take that damage every time. Okay, off we go. Boop. Give me them cards, boy. I think he's going to give me the cards instead of take the damage. Because I think he's... He's going to be pretty concerned here. Uh, how much damage he's going to be taking, I think. Oh, he's going to take the damage. Okay, bud. Yeah, it comes by. I just get to keep doing it, bud. Must remove it from play. Removing my risk factor from the game. There's a, some card that was doing that with, in black. That has been incredibly uh, debilitating to my deck. Right, you can take some damage. This is chicken. Sure, you take the damage. It works for me, bud. Okay, sounds good. So we're going to... Drop this, we'll play this. Submit. Take the damage or give me the cards. At this point in the game, he'll probably give me the cards. Oh, okay. Sounds good, bud. So if I draw a spark, he's done. Any life gain. Some life that way, fine. That touch life link, okay. Game's over. <sighs> Game is over. This thing.
Alonzo. He's got more... hate that. I hate that more than anything. These just turns that take forever to get through and you know you're going to just lose. I hate it more than anything. Alright, here we go. We got Sicarius here. Sicarius. Muswasi. Mulligan that bad boy. Keep this bad boy. <laughs> Dropping a spitter. No, I gotta mulligan again. I have to mulligan again. Useless. Keep this, I guess. Get rid of a shock and the helix. Oh boy. Oops, I think I'm gonna lose this game too. We can't go down to five and not have a. And not have a. Uh... And, you know, without the ley line at five, I'm way behind on value. Razor, put a land card around, tap. So he's got some ramp on top of me being behind. Much better cards than I have. But that is okay. We still got our little value engine going. So we'll have a field, we'll have some shock, we'll hit him with the skewer, the critic. Draw land, maybe. Boo boy. protect you. Okay. Well. Okay. So, can't deal with that. Boom. Time for plan B. Only time will tell. All right, draw land, draw land, draw land. Really based on that Tafari. He's got a color across the board. He's got every color in play, but uh, black, green. No, he's got them all. So, homeboy, homeboy, full up. I'm gonna draw a card. Got nothing. Just way behind on lands here. This guy's got something big cooking. I'm way behind. Not getting my land drops. Still no land. I don't know what this guy's deck is doing. Oh, there we go. That's what his deck is doing. No idea what this guy was trying to do. Spitfire. Take the damage, take the damage. Alright, skewer the critics. One, two, the reach. Got him! 
how you have all them lands, all them cards, and still lose like that. That's insane. Insane in the membrane. So, um, we got one more we can play quick. I have to, um, I have some laundry going. I have to go switch into the dryer. So, you know, I'm trying to utilize my time between work very productively, as you can tell. Um, so I'll play this one, and then I'll probably go check on the dryer here, see if that can't be switched over. Um, so yeah, probably about that 30 minute mark will be gone for a minute or two. Um, Mulligan that bad boy. We will take this bad boy, but it's not much better. I'm going to get rid of the insight, because that just seems so far away. Like, it just doesn't seem like I'm ever going to play it. So there we go. We got some shocks going on. So we have some low value. Uh, turn stuff now. I can hit him with the shock. Whatever he plays next, I'm going to hit with the shock. Auto passing. He's got a block at the end of my turn, it looks like. So he's going to play something to deal with that. No, he's keeping an eye out, so. He's just keeping an eye on it. Less fun. I get my shit going. Play this bad boy. Sure. No attacks. Fine. Sure. Play that. Play the risk factor. Drop. A shock. Give me them lands, boy. No, you won't give me them lands. Excellent. up to kill one. I don't want him to kill one. I want them to keep doing their thing. Welcome okay. Yep. That sucked. That sucked. That sucked. That sucked. That was not a good time. The game totally froze there. It had to Recalibrate for me a little bit. And we chump or trade. Either way.
Fuck you and your counters, bro. Fuck you and your counters. You can counter these nuts. Sorry, language. Language. My apologies. I apologize profusely. Profusely apologize for that language. Him keeping that shield, him getting rid of that field saved him the game, so. Uh, sure. Here we go, boys. Encounter that. I assume he'll counter it. He didn't say please. Yeah, that's fine. I'm so salty from that. I'm gonna go get my laundry and I may or may not come back. I haven't decided. <laughs> Very salty.
have decided I can play. I can keep playing. So let's get back to it. All right. Two wins today. A couple losses. All right, fifty-fifty on the day. Uh, <laughs> so salty. Let's see what we can do. it I guess I just had such bad land like I've had terrible mana the last couple games just miserable miserable mana um why would you do that Play both spitters next turn. Actually, it did screw me up. Huh, interesting. Did he, get, he gets one of my cards? And that, whatever the fuck that was. <laughs> this thing is gonna get beefy. I'm imagine as long as it doesn't. Probably the last episode of this magic series I do. Arg! Very unsatisfying. I even had, like, he picked through my, like, it didn't matter. He just torched it. Like, the two damage from the thing, it did not even matter to him. Ever. Not even once. So... Some idiot is responding to me on the internet.
see what shock. Used up all your good shocks right away, bud. Heard that. <sighs> he knows I don't have anything. How am I doing so poor? Like, I'm getting mis- I'm just getting mana screwed every single game. surrender still might surrender he'll give me he'll spot me the cards oh nope. that was good he probably didn't he shouldn't have that's fine I'll concede I've lost that one he has the Chandra he's got a better bet board state I have half of my cards locked behind a color I don't have. If I had that in play on the previous game, I would have been better off. I'm going to stop talking to this guy on the internet. I'm going to stop commenting. Just stop commenting. Help. Cards, boy. Oh, boy.
added haste too. That's fun. A haste, vigilance, death touch. Anything else you want to put on there, bud? All right, full salt is in session here. Full salt. This is about as good a hand as I can get, so I'll just have to make it work. That, that fricker always has to go the second I see him. Fricker has to go the moment you see him. It's very miserable. Feels better than losing, that's for sure. Feels better than losing, but we have not made any real progress here. Hillary, you know, had some salt. Had a nice sprinkling of salt today, but haven't had any usable fun. I don't know, is this even fun? I don't know. I, nothing I do in life even feels like fun anymore. I don't understand why my draws are so poor. I'll take this one. 
All right, here's hoping they're targeting me quite a bit. Here's hoping they are targeting me quite a bit. Yeah, I know I go first. I'm waiting on my opponent. Keep six. Put the pyrohelix back. Start with those in play. Big sexy with glasses. I like them apples. I hope you target me quite a bit. I hope you got nothing but mill and removal. Mill and removal would be just just dandy. Yeah, I think he's having a tough time comprehending the double A line there. So boop play land bud play land for turn play card elves no once upon a time is a ridiculous card once upon a time in the west mad man lost his damn mind in the west Okay. Yeah. Blue black. I'll, I like the look of blue black. Blue black tends to have some targets of me. Reach. That's fine. He's gonna put that right in his. He's gonna put that into play. Tap. Nope. Okay. Scry. If he scries top, that's bad. Usually scry bottom. So, get the research out, get, hopefully draw a field. If I draw a field or, draw a field would be the best thing to see. Um, you gotta figure out what he's gonna do around those ley lines. Gotta figure out what you can do with them ley lines, huh, bud? What do you know? He scried bottom. I'll probably hold the spitter. Hold the shock, even though I got the spitter. the spitter for a turn. He'll probably block, deal the damage to the grazer. Get it out of the way. Nope. Do that. So static field is in play, you guys. Electraco stato copo field. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, that guy has to go. Thief of Sanity always has to go. He's a prop. So this guy has to go. Sorry, Firemine. It's fine, because I couldn't have Mem 2. Uh, I'm still mana, mana short. boss got a little bit of a 
value engine going now, boss. He doesn't have to reveal the exile time. Okay. Land, draw land, draw land, draw land, draw land, Eric. Chandra Spitfire would be acceptable as well, but I prefer to draw land. Alright, bad boy, I'll cast that. Discard. Boom, boom, boom. Probably take the damage. He's got a boost on the grazer. Target me, bish. Kill me. Alright, this will probably be the last one here. The, again, the salt is very real. Uh, play these games only if you actually enjoy playing them. Uh, if it's important that you win or lose. The only thing that sucks is, like, again, I have the hardest time with, uh, like, just just dealing with how slow it takes to lose, you know what I mean? Like, it'd be fine if, it, you know what I mean? I do not enjoy how slowly I lose. I would just rather lose quickly. So... Sorry, I was not paying attention there.
protection from Rad. It's no fun. You burn some counters, boss. I hate a big scary blue deck, though. And this should be a legendary land, huh? Bad times, here it comes. Here comes the here comes the punishment. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. So we'll do whoop. these sort of blue control decks like freaking Eldraine made the magic I used to play against as a kid that I hated super popular so that's that's fun so he's got a bunch of cards left to counter me I'm just I'm done I'm done in a hype If I'd have had the stupid uh, thing out, the ley line, I'd be better off here and against this type of deck because it's got a little return. I'm still waiting on my fourth land to this guy's seven.
that's enough for one day. Uh, I think I had fun. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day. Take care.